All right, so let's say you're just getting started out with MA, like I was um, about a year ago, and this can look a little overwhelming, right? There are so many different things, like what if you don't know what a selection grid is or what the phaser window is, or like you're going through all of these different things and you're like, what are these? I don't know um, what any of this is, right? Well, guess what? MA did think of a, a way to help you with that. Um, it's called, it, it's a little thing called help, and it's on this little question mark thing over here. You can tag it, see this little green line there. It puts help line in the command line here. Now, before you get started, this is not going to help you resolve any particular issue in a particularly um, uh, quick manner. It's more of a reference, um, not really. A, if, if you guys need help, you get on the MA forums, or you, if you're in the US, you contact uh, your distributor, which would be ACT. Um, and they're going to get you the specifics. But if you're just starting out and you kind of want some general knowledge about what uh, a specific thing does, maybe you're playing around with different windows like this, and you're just kind of like, what's the playback window? Well, put help on the command line, and then go over here and tag the MA key. And you are going to get a little uh, overview of what you just selected. So you can see here, I just uh, I put help on the command line, and then I have the MA section over here on the playback window. And it went to this little what are executors. Executors are handled. So this is really great overview content. It quickly goes through everything. And it's much quicker than just going through the manual and trying to learn stuff. Um, I actually recommend that if you are really wanting to learn MA, you set up a show file first. You kind of figure out how to do all that. And then you don't even need to store any of this. You don't need to set up a 3D. Just get some stuff in there. And then use the help button and go kind of get your overviews. Um, and that will just kind of help get you an outline, you can do it over here as well. I'll show you what a preset pool is. Um, put it on, you go to 3D. It's going to give you all of that info. Really, really helpful. Um, and, you know, a really great. I use this a lot when I was starting out. Um, and I'm really glad that MA uh, included it. Like I said, this is not really a uh, going to help you solve any particular issue. Maybe if you're just starting out and you're kind of like, well, how do I do, you know, um, you know, how do I create a all uh, one to five kind of preset pool or something, right? It might help you, but that is the help key. I used it a lot. Check it out. It's often forgotten in all of these uh, little things up here, and people are kind of like, "Well, I just want an overview of what um, what I can do with executors or what I can do with sequences and stuff like that." And the help button will quickly uh, find that in the manual for you and will give you that overview. So check it out. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have a lot more coming. I've been a little not very active the past couple of weeks because I've had a lot of stuff going on, a lot of shows. Gigs are getting you know started again, which is awesome. But uh, I'll be back more, and uh, hopefully we're going to have MA3 version uh, 1.5 soon. I was told it was coming in April, and now it's June, and I'm like, hmm, okay. But I'm excited for that, and I'll make a video going over that when that releases. So check it out. Thanks so much, guys. Catch you later.